and we're off. Ritzy Outdoor Adventure, and we've got a good crew of lads with us today. We're on the Tay, we're up in Scotland, and we're doing a five day trip down the Tay. Or, with the levels as they are, we might do it in a day and a half. But no, we're out here for the duration. So, like I say, I've got a good crew with me. I'll introduce you to the lads later on. But if you look behind me there, there's Adam, canoe man. See you? Easy there. Easy now. In front, down there, we've got John, Forrester Outdoors. I've got Kyle next to me there, just cruising along with a big cigar. We've got Jack behind with his beanie hat on, straight from the Oasis concert. And behind in the back there, Elliot following up there with his uh, looking cool with that hat on. What do they call them? Trill Beast? Tilly hats, that's the one, Tilly hats. So yeah, we're out on an adventure. So stick with us and see what we get up to. Catch you in a bit. We're on lock here. Popped into the head of the lock. And uh, we're just saying we're lucky with wind because it's been howling this morning, aren't we? Yeah, so we're uh, getting a bit of a battery up more to here with two boats on top. And uh, but we're a bit like it might be a bit wild on here, but at the minute, touch wood, it's uh, blowing in with favour and uh, it's nice, it's nice and fresh because, uh, well not fresh but dry, dry suits on, you're a bit of a boil in the bag situation with dry suits on so it's nice to have a little bit overcast at the minute, but well, like I say the wind's alright, it's looking fantastic. No billy dog I'm afraid so yeah but He'll be alright at home, but I did feel a bit guilty leaving him. But uh, plenty of more adventures for him. There's quite a few sort of grade three ish rapids on this trip, and uh, there's a fair bit of water knocking about, so there's enough concentrating on myself getting down these rapids without having the pressure of getting Billy Dog down safe. But yeah, it's going to be a good adventure. Absolutely love it. Anyway, stick with us and see what sort of an adventure we have. I'm sure it's going to be a good one. We're on the hunt for a campsite now. Just uh, trying to find something. Just been out and had a bunch of up there. And uh, it's one of them, isn't it? When, you, when you're on a trip like this. It's how much you keep looking because you're never going to find that perfect spot. Well, you might do, but uh, you might camp in a shit tip and then you set off in the morning and 100 yards down, down bloody lock or whatever. There's a beautiful campsite. So, but I've anyway, just checked one out. It's all right, you make it do, but we must be able to find better. So, we're going to have a mooch along, see if we're going to find something better along here. Well, cool, you set up, man. <laughs> Get out for a settle. <laughs> Proper like uh, concoction in it, but working, do it job, in it. Yeah, no, it's It's working well. Yeah, yeah. Really, it's it. Yes, that. So I'm rocking the nature right cloud peak for this trip. Fantastic tent, bit of room in it, so it's grand to be able to sit in there and move about quite easily, sit up and uh, you can fit a nice big pad in it if you want loads of room. So, and a cracking pitch right next to the water. So it's amazing what it does just to, we looked at one pitch, ummed and hard about it, was close to stopping there, moved on 100 metres down and we found a mint pitch that's miles better. Great place to have a fire on beach. So, yeah, ready for a bit of scram. So we're going to get this set up, I'm going to get a brew on. And then I'll be uh, having a bit of scram before too long. We're in camp. 
we get we're more or less set up. Well, everyone's set up. Time to get some tea on and stuff. Young lads have been on a mission. Well, I say it, young lads are not young anymore. Get, get Elliot, Elliot over there grafting. Yeah. But young lads are getting stuck in. Well, like I say, I say young lads, they're not they're out, out young buggers now. To you, Rick, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, young compared to us. <laughs> but yeah, they're all getting stuck in with firewood and what have you, so I'll have to do my bit in a bit. We're getting brews on. Brews are on. I've got a brew made. John's just sparking his brew up. Jack's just chilling there, having a, having a bit of dinner and a brew. Well, finishing his dinner, but yeah, time to get tea on. I think Adam's having uh, 40 winks in his hammock. Having a chill axe, unless he's got his tea on over here, but yeah, cracking spot. So, well, let's uh, we'll get some scranning with bellies. We'll wait till it starts to get a bit darker and we'll spark the fire up. Right, Jimmy Lundy, if you're watching this, different pan this time, fire maple pan. It ain't gonna get tipped out fire. Yeah. I've not, I've not a car for a lot of them, I'm just starting to start some branching. Have a little have a little go. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Adam loves his badges. Yeah, he's got a tattoo of a badger on his hand there. You can see it there. That's Badger's face. First time I met him, I was thinking, what is it? That took me ages to suss it out. But it's the Badger's face. Yeah, 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 yeah. But uh, hey, we've got the whiskey out now. So Kyle's dishing the whiskey out. I've. Uh, I've, I've, I've been a, a Neanderthal or, or whatever you might call it. I've brought Irish whiskey to Scotland. A bit of Jameson's Irish whiskey in Scotland. So what's that all about? You enjoying that whiskey, Jack? Is it yeah, nice? It's and what's what's that one, Cal? It's got a little bit of water with it. <coughs> yeah. Ben Bracken. Ben Bracken. No, it's just one of it's Aldi one, that. Right, is it? It's one of the, like the nicer, nicer right. Aldi ones. It's one I've never had. Yeah, they got three. One's like quite peppery, one's quite citrusy, and what this is, um, moisy panic. Moisy panic. Okay, okay. It's nice. Yeah, I got sacked. I wrote the car up once, and honestly, from one side of it, it looked pristine and perfect. Have you ever, have you ever seen us, No. <laughs> no. Was they like, all right with that? One, no, yeah, yeah. One rip passenger seat, oh, and one rip, one rip back, right? Cracking night and uh, cracking day really. Look forward to another day tomorrow. Bit of rain on the tent. Hey, beautiful. As long as it don't rain too much, there's enough water in that river as it is. <laughs> day two. Belting night in camp last night. So we're all getting on water. Adam's there behind me just launching. Uh, John's just on in front there. We've got uh, Jack and Elliot up here. Carl's just getting in now. Having it, or is it? Oh no, we've got Jackie. We've got Elliot and Carl. Jack's just chilling out. I don't know if you can see him there, but he's getting his last 40 winks. I won't mind, but he were an hour in bed longer than all the rest of us, and all, weren't he? <laughs> he's catching up on his emails. He's got a big smile on his face, so he must be talking to Bird. Eh? <laughs> I reckon so. so let's do it, lads, eh? So our camp's left nice and clean, we've cleared up everything, took over crap, just a few eggshells, that's about it. So, fire pit will get washed away properly when water rises a little bit if we're only on stones. So, yeah, we're laughing. We'll see what today brings, eh? Black calm on here this morning, it's plumbing stunning. So we're heading into the head of the tear now. Look at this, what a gorgeous bridge. Cross this bridge and we're away. We're on the river. So we're on the river and we're moving downhill. Like I say, 400 meters to the bottom. 
Yeah. Ja. Looking cool, isn't it, Elliot, man? Mint. Oh, fan fantastic to get on some moving water. Absolutely fantastic. Look at this now, eh? Absolutely beautiful. Look at this, man. No doubt there's going to be plenty of trees to uh, avoid, similar to this one. Stunning. Stunning. What an absolutely great start to river. Rapid after rapid. <laughs> it's going to be fun, this one. Make a Yeah, wow!
Well, that was epic. Fair bit of this, fair bit of bailing out on that one. One broken seat, and we had two lads stuck in a stopper at the bottom of this last broken wheel. So both of them lads ended up having to swim out of this stopper with the boats. But uh, oh, hey, all part of the fun, eh? <laughs> all part, all part of the fun. <laughs> So camp two, what a mint day today was. Yep. Yeah. So a couple of classic rapids. Cracking day. Everyone down safely. Mint campsite. So we're getting set up for it night. Which is why I didn't want to go the other way. At least you did it proper way though, I'd just whack a firelighter on there and be done with it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no wrong with that though mate, when you're canoeing and you're frigging, you know what I mean? <coughs> you'd be the it's fucking, not, it's nice to do it. it down, nobody's going to get it going, you'd be like the fucking gods are using it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Rick will get it going. Well there's no romanticism in uh, staying warm and fucking, you know what I mean, the old, the old guys back in days into... Uh, you know these old people out there in 1600s in America and everywhere, trailblazing and that. They they weren't shy about using whatever they had. Yeah, true. Yeah. There's no no like I've got to do it by bloody <laughs> <laughs> flint and steel or whatever, whatever you've got. Just get it going. Quick walk round camp as the kettle boils. Morning Adam, you alright? Adam's just checking up on his messages, chilling on the tarp there. He's an hammock man, Adam, through and through. And we've got, uh, yeah, get a brew on. We've got Kyle set up there, Jack set up over there. We've got John down here. Yeah, most people are flying types, drying a bit of gear. Elliot's just there, chilling up, checking on his messages as well. But uh, my bit of a shit tip here at minute, stuff everywhere at minute. But uh, yeah, it was a, a night for flying types to dry a bit of gear underneath. And yeah, kettle boiling. Oh, let's get a brew on. Day three, and what a gorgeous morning. I didn't realise it was so beautiful. We've been in the woods. You'll have seen last night where we had that little fire on top of the bank. Fantastic spot. But uh, got ready in the woods, packed all the gear, come down onto the river and we're in the open and it's absolutely stunningly gorgeous. So let's see what today brings, eh? Gorgeous morning, eh, Adam? Beautiful when you get on river, innit? Into the sunshine here. It's gonna be another sweat box, aren't we? No. Oh. Quick dinner stop. Keeping my eye on this bullet background. Uh, everyone's ready to sprint and jump in the boats. But, uh, Get a bit of scram down my next, but yeah, absolute stunning day. Beautiful. A bit warm in a uh, dry suit, but when you're on a river you've not done before, you don't know what's coming up next, so it's like if you've done it before you might think like it's not a dry suit day today, I'll just stick my uh, shorts and t-shirt on, but anyway, it's right in it.
looking excellent, isn't it? Fantastic. We found a campsite for tonight. Took a bit of lucky tonight. It's uh, it's not the sort of river where they're abundantly obvious, you know. So we took a bit of finding tonight, but we found a cracker, haven't we, lads? Hey, uh, good spot. So we're on a spit of land, so it's banging. So unless we get some torrential rain and it comes up two or three meters, you know, we should be all right. But other than that, we're going to tarp camp, I think. So if it does come up two or three meters, we just drop the drop the uh, paddles, wrap the tarp round us, roll into the boat, and off we go. Yeah, Bobby Dazzler, right like that. Put our helmet on further down the river. You know what I mean? So, well, yeah, looks all right. It'll do the job, lads, won't it? Ah, oh, banging, they're good. So that's my setup for it, mate. We're uh, flying the tarp over the uh, canoe. Just pinned down with a pile of rocks here. Alright, we've used a paddle at this back end just to uh, secure this back end with a load of rocks. And, uh, yeah, streamline enough, so should be right that, won't it? Good job, won't it? Yeah, bit of a shanty town tonight, but it's uh, going to be right. What a place to have it. Look at this view here, right in front of the tarp. Look at that. Hey, you're waking up looking at that, eh? It's not bad, is it, eh? We've got different things knocking about. Some of the lads have put tents up and what have you around here. And, uh Adam, similar to me over this, seat. he's uh, he does this sort of thing all the time with barbell fishing outside at rivers and setting up camps and what have you. So he's got a mint spot there. Nice bit of shelter where he's picked as well. I'm a little bit more open, but fingers crossed it'd be right. Time to get a brew on, eh? Indefinitely. Six o'clock, I think I'm gonna have a brew before me tea. Yeah, definitely. Ready for a brew, just have a brew and a biscuit. Chill for a bit. Fantastic. Now that's a good hearty pile of scrap after a day on river. Mashed potatoes and beans. Look around here, lads. In bonfire, Nick. Fuck. 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 Uh, yeah. I started doing like bits for a little film, you know. What today? I, yeah. Why well, not? Last few days, that one from when we set up and that. Right. You know, just fucked it off today. Yeah. Not got anything. <laughs> Nothing. Just, just weren't feeling it today. It's ruined it, it? Can't be bothered. You just missed the whole day in a little video. <laughs> top night round campfire, top night overall. It's a lot fresher tonight, which is beautiful. It's like you can feel autumn coming, stars are out. Well, the hat's on tonight because it's cold. Well, it's not cold, it's a lot fresher, but uh, wrapped up under here, fantastic. River's just over there, but yeah, what a great night. What a fantastic trip. Top to, top top team. <laughs> I've had a couple of whiskies. So but yeah, top team. Top top blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I've definitely had a couple of whiskies. But top group of lads. Yeah. Good campfire chat. Good chill. Loving it. Right, let's get my head down. I'll see you in the morning.
See you later. <clears throat> what a fantastic night. Best sleep I've had. Back to where I belong under a tarp. Yeah, I loved it. Great night. There's a couple of these big birch on this island where we camped that the beavers have uh, took down. You can see all the teeth marks. Get stay at that. But uh, be rude not to get a bit of birch bark while I'm here, wouldn't it? Well, that's it, we're afloat, we're on the river again. Bit of a lazy state today. Possibly the last leg of the trip, this. Some good rapids coming up. <clears throat> yep, some good features that we might run, we might portage. We'll just have to see, like I say, there's a lot of water in the river. Never run it before, so we'll just see what we find when we get there. So, me and Adam, last two to get on river. We'll catch these lads up and we'll see what the day brings. So well, this is one of the rapids. So you see down it. That's whether we go around it, through it, or what. Just find a little bit of whack for it to me. Yeah. Jack's going for it. Hey Jack, what are you thinking? Let's check it out. Is that the best way down there? Oh yeah, yeah. Cheers man. <laughs> I go down this one here. Well, I don't want to do that though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I think this is probably the best option. What about you? Yeah, I've got a look, lead up. Go on, Jack, mate. Go on. I've got to say, my fucking hair's standing on end. Go on, Jack, lad. Come on, Jack. Come on, Jack. Oh, what a... This is... Jeez, that was absolutely bloody gorgeous. Thank God. Good lad, good lad. Woo! Fantastic, now that were a sweet line and all lads, weren't it? Absolutely nailed it then lads then, didn't they? What a line. Bloody fantastic.
So we're nearing the end now. We've just done the Stanley Weir and uh, what a fantastic trip it's been. A couple of more bits and pieces to go and we'll be uh, we'll be getting towards the finish spot. So a bit gutted to finish, but what an absolute bloody belter of a trip, aren't it? Brilliant, like, eh? four days. Mega. We've loved Couldn't it. Have been better. Absolutely. Couldn't have been better, could Couldn't it? Couldn't have been better. Beautiful. Absolutely bloody beautiful. Some close action flushes, man. Well that's a wrap and what a fantastic trip and absolutely mint to be out with these lads. Top team, we've had a great time. Top camps, top banter, top paddling. I hope you've enjoyed the film. Anyway, from Rick T, Outdoors and the rest of the boys. Easy now. We'll catch you again soon. See you ladies. Ta-da.